welcome to TK's Diaries. I know I haven't done a diary in a while, but I'm back. It is January 2014, and I hope your 2013 was a wonderful year. Um, I want to let you all know that in Birmingham, Alabama, if you live within 60 miles from here, we will have our own support group that's by the patients and for the patients. So, not only are patients encouraged to come out every fourth Saturday for the support groups, but we also encourage parents and caregivers, and even if you have sickle cell trait, come out and learn more about what's going on in the world of sickle cell. Our December meeting was our first meeting and we talked about ports, the placement of ports and why, why would you get a port and um, just A to Z about ports. Um, and for those of you who don't know what ports are, they, they are like a, um, it's a place, mine's right here, it sticks out from out of my skin but it's it's an easy way for the doctors and nurses to be able to access, wow. <laughs> it's an easy way for the doctors to be able to access um, your body to give you what you need as far as um, electrolytes, um, fluids, and medication. So we talked about that in December. In January, on actually January the 25th we will meet and we will talk about housing and all of the housing that's available to people who have sickle cell disease because you know we are considered disabled even though I don't consider myself disabled but there's so many things out there available to us houses um, like credits to pay your rent if you live in an apartment, special apartments um, for people with disabilities, um, and you may not have to pay any rent. We also will talk about um, homes that could potentially become yours and how in Alabama they're trying to make it really easy for you to get a loan for a home that has been built specifically for someone who has a disability. And after so many years, the home becomes yours. But you will learn all about housing and how you can get free housing if you have sickle cell disease. Just in case you don't attend the meeting on January 25th, and it's from 12 to 2 at the Homewood Library in room 108. If you don't attend, there is a newsletter that I'm going to start putting out this month in January. So you'll get all of the information still in the newsletter. So if, you, if you're not able to come out, that's fine. Um, but please, please hit me up on Facebook. You can find me as Tina K, T-I-N-A-K-A-Y. And send me your email address so we can add you to our list and you will get a reminder about the meetings. Also send me your phone number because we do have a calling tree and we call to remind you about the meetings. So there's lots going on. We meet every fourth Saturday from 12 to 2 at the Homewood Library right outside of Birmingham, Alabama. So if you live elsewhere and you're interested in some of the things that I'm talking about, um, I'll be more than happy to help you find the person in your area that you need to talk to. So, come on people in the Birmingham area. If you know someone who has sickle cell disease, who lives with a trait, or if it's a parent or caregiver, they need to start attending these meetings because like I said, it's for us and by us. We set the agenda. So, that is what I have to tell you for now, until next month, um, or until next time, see you when I see you. Thank you.